There's a rule some coaches want to change that would completely alter the way college football is played, and for one team, their offense would be screwed. In football, when a player is tackled outside of the hash marks painted on the field, the ball is then set up on those hash marks to start the next play. One of the biggest differences between NFL football and college football is how wide these hash marks are apart. In the NFL, it's 18 feet 6 inches. In college, it's 40 feet. Many people believe that this opens up the passing game more in the NFL, and it also makes it easier for defenses to discuss their coverages in the NFL. And some college coaches are getting louder and louder about wanting things to change. Those hash marks were built for, you know, football a long time ago. I want the hash marks to look like the NFL. Now there's one head coach that's already fighting this, and that's because he sticks his receivers as close to the sideline as possible when his team is on the far hash. That makes it easier for his quarterback to read coverage, and it puts the defense in a tough spot having to cover all that grass. That team, the Tennessee Volunteers.